Hi guys, welcome you again to another news. It has just been said by Adams Oshomole, who have said that Atiku and Peter will be failed together with the PDP tickets in 2019. These people cannot win individually in 2023. These people were together back in 2019 and they failed together now that they've separated and they are now standing on their own individually tell me these people can't win that is what has been said by adams Oshumale. well we would like you to see that as we go into the full details of the news if you are coming across this channel for the very first time don't just watch and leave the subscribe and don't forget to turn on the bell icon to get you notified anytime we post a new update and also a big shout out to our subscribers. I want to say a big thank you to you for liking, sharing, and commenting. I want to implore you to continue to do so. And as you do, you mean blush. Now to the full gist of the news. Former Edo State Governor and a chieftain of the whole Progressive Congress, Adams Oshomole, has said what the presidential candidates of the People's Democratic Party and Labour Party, Atiku Abubakar and Peter Obi failed to get together, cannot be attained by either one of them. Atiku and Obi were respectively the presidential and vice presidential candidates of the PDP in the 2019 election, which was won by incumbent president Muhammad Buhari. Shomale said since they failed together in 2019, it is sure that they will fail individually in 2023 now that they are presidential candidates of separate parties. The former governor during an interview on Channel's television on which they said Atiku is more favored in the South South and Southeast than in the northern part of the country. Just four years ago, His Excellency Atiku Abubakar and my dear friend Peter Obi, the former governor of Anambra State, they had a combined ticket and that combined Force challenged the APC and Buhari, and unlike in 2015, Buhari scored more votes against the combined ticket of Atiku and Peter Obi. Together they failed. How can they possibly win? Divided, and their constituency is the same. If you check Atiku's votes, you will find that he got more votes in the South South and South East than he got in the entire North. So, he was more favored in the South than in the North, he said. He added that Buhari lost in the South South and South East in 2015 and 2019 elections. He said if the electorate retains the 2015 and 2019 voting patterns, it means APC will lose again in the two regions. If the voting pattern remains the same, it means that they will not vote for APC. I'm confident that in terms of unifying figure, Senator Bola Ametinobu, the APC presidential candidate, is ahead of the two of them what they couldn't together get they can get it as individuals he said he said although president muhammad buhari will not contest in 2023 the epicentre will benefit from his support base president buhari is not eligible to recontest I believe APC will still benefit from his support base because those who believed in him still believe in him. With President Muhammadu's voice on the side of Asiwaju, that's a huge electoral asset, he said. 
Speaking about the results of the opinion poll released by Bloomberg on Wednesday, Oshumale said it lacks credibility as it was conducted by the supporters of Peter Obi to sway public opinion. He added that a poll conducted by economic intelligence units believed Tunubu will win the election but was not out on social media because some people did not find the results satisfactory. He said, In this environment, all sorts of things happen. You consistently ignore the findings of the economic intelligence unit that says, from the evaluation, they believe Ashiwaju will win. There will be a lot of fake opinions poll, but they are not more than opinion polls, even if they were published by fairly well-known, credible people who are seasoned occasions that are known to be seasoned in the business of opinion polling, he added. He said, the APC Campaign Council, which was meant to be inaugurated on Wednesday, could not be inaugurated because the Director General of the campaign was away in New York, United States. He said, the Campaign Council will be inaugurated as soon as the Director General of the Campaign Council returns from New York by this weekend. Meanwhile, some reporters in a reported that the inauguration of the council had been shifted indefinitely because Tinubu left Nigeria to seek medical treatment abroad. Sources told some reporters that the alien APC presidential candidate went sought medical tourism in London, United Kingdom. What is your take to this? What is your own reaction to this brand development? We would like you to let us know your own take on this. We would like you to share your own point of view with us by the comment section, just like what we've had. That article and Peter Obi were together in 2019 and they couldn't win. So, what is the probability that now that they have separated and they are the presidential candidates of different parties, that these people will emerge as winners? Of course, they can win. That is what Oshomale have said. Since they can win together back then in 2019, forget it. They can win individually. We would like you to let us know your own point of view. Just like to share it with us via the comment section. Do you think now that they are no longer together, it could favor them even than when they were together? Well, we would like you to share it with us via the comment section on this. Shomala is no longer for people in one room. Obis coming. Know this and have peace. That is what has been said by Solomon, who have reacted quickly to this saying, Peter will be is coming. Know this and have peace. A statement to Shomale. What is your take to this? Buari failed three times in the past two times and ANPPN once with, you know, two times with ANPP and once with CPC before he won with APC at his fourth attempt, so you can't deceive people like me. I am not gullible. And the reaction from Udoka and your fool. We would like you to let us know your own thoughts on these different reactions from different people. Don't forget that Atiku Peter will be failed together with PDP ticket in 2019. They can win individually in 2023. That's what Adam Sosiomale have said. Thank you guys for listening. Subscribe to this channel if you have not, and I will see you on other news. Bye for now.